finally, we have got the pistons and a piston rod set. Uh, no thanks to DHL, of course, who are totally useless. Um, it took two weeks to get here. Well, it took probably a bit less than that, to be fair. About five days from shipping. Um, but it went missing for a day or so after, as usual, they delivered it to my door, or said they did, sent me a photograph of where it delivered. It wasn't even my house. Not only was it not my house, God knows where it was. It took me ages to find it. Anyway, it eventually turned up. And I must say, that's the second time DHL have done this from Germany. Um, last time it went to India and then Texas and then turned up in England six weeks later, which is pretty shocking. So I'd never use them. Anyway, right, the kit. Let's have a look. We've got to fiddle through this. So we've got the oil filter. There he is. In there. And the pan. We've got some German news. Piston rod, the uh, numbers on them for matching, we'll obviously have two of those, we have got a piston, there we go, a cast piston, nicely machined isn't it? So these have got, uh, one goes in with the text facing up and one goes in with the text facing down. I think from memory these two divot things point facing each other to give you some clue. Um, but I will check that before I install them, which I'll show you anyway. But it's a nice piston, quite weighty. Um, it just feels well made and well finished. We've got the wrist pin for it. And we've got two sets of um, rings. So we'll look at these. Yeah. Let's have a look what we've got here. So, uh, one, two, three, nicely numbered. And if you look carefully, you can see there's um, a diagram telling you which uh, slot to put them in. And then down here is the oil scraper on number three, which is a three part, there we go, it's a three part scraper ring. Which personally, I find them a bit fiddly to install, but they're all the vogue and they seem to be quite popular. Chat in there. Right, so we've also got the journals which are 41.23, which is correct, it's the size I ordered. Um, the white metal of some kind. And the, from memory, you had to put um, a chamfer on these when you install them because they grip the rod, the uh, crank on the KS600 and 750 too tight without it from memory, anyway. So we need to do that. And all I've got in here, other than that, is um, some C clips. Got one more bag in the bottom of bits, some paints that are looking here. Spring, the engine, and there you go, some nicely finished Ryber bolts. These ones are for the generator. There's a few others for finishing the bike off. Right, that's it, that's your kit. I think it was about £800 from memory. Um, it's pretty good, uh, you know, it's not cheap, but it's well made and you can tell it's properly engineered. It's all decent stuff. It's not just been knocked out somewhere. Um, so I'm quite pleased with it. And then next up, we're going to go and install it.